Hey guys, Steve with Bass Fishing Electronics here today. Uh, just wanted to go over some quick tips for the ionic lithium batteries. One of the most common questions we get is uh, my battery's dead and I can't, it won't take a charge and I, I can't figure out how to get my battery back up. And um, Nine times out of ten what's happened here is the customer has ran the battery down to the point where it goes into protection mode. And once the battery is in protection mode, it's going to show zero volts if you measure it with the multimeter and the battery's also not going to register on your app. So what we're going to do is uh, we're going to come over here right now and I'm going to show you how we're going to troubleshoot this. So here we've got a couple lithium ionic batteries here. Um, we just got a basic set of jumper cables I made up. I keep these in the boat just in case. You can use car jumper cables, whatever you have. But as you can see, we're just going to take uh, the positive here to the positive of the other battery, negative here to the negative of the other battery. And we're just going to leave this for 10 to 15 seconds. And what that's going to do is wake that battery up and then you're going to be able to charge that battery. Now that our battery is out of protection mode, we can come in here to the Ionic app and we can see that our battery is now being charged. And there's a lot of other helpful info in here. You can see the voltage on the battery. You can see how fast the battery is charging right now. So we can see that there's six amps going to the battery as well as how long it's going to take to fully charge that. One other thing I want to say, it, you know, if you wake that battery up and you're still not registering it in your app and you're not seeing anything happening here, um, you most likely get a charger issue at that point. So simply take one of the other charger leads that you know is good, uh, remove the current one from the bad battery, and then put the new charger leads to that and test it that way. And that'll eliminate whether it's the battery, the charger, or, or what you have going on there. I hope this helps, guys, and make sure you like and subscribe to our YouTube channel, and uh, we'll keep more videos coming. Thank you.